Following a strong showing at the Cannes Film Festival, this Prohibition-era gangster film was released theatrically on August 29, 2012, going on to gross over just $50 million. Shia LaBeouf and Tom Hardy star as outlaw bootleggers, deep in the woods of Virginia, whose illegal moonshining operation is threatened by a hotshot lawman from Chicago, played by Guy Pearce. There's a new special deputy. He's been brought in from the city to help us out, you know, make sure things go smooth. What things might they be? <laughs> Sorry, something to amuse you. My name is Charlie Riggs. I'm from Chicago. Who the hell is this son of a bitch? Me. I'm the one who's going to make your life real difficult from now on if you don't toe the line, country boy. Don't you ever touch me again. Based on a true story written by the protagonist's real-life grandson, Lawless is a brooding and slow-moving 115-minute drama dripping with tension and character. Unfortunately, it takes director John Hillcote nearly 45 minutes to actually unfold the plot proper. The first half of this film is devoid of any action, development, or interesting dialogue. These uninteresting early scenes are sort of disconnected from each other, with few elements threading them together. Just as I began to question if this film was actually going to be a waste of my time, it thankfully came roaring back in a rewarding and thematic final chapter. Even if the complicated and historically fascinating Prohibition story is entirely abandoned for a very basic revenge plot. Sharing parallels to The Godfather, this is a quiet film with quick bursts of intense graphic violence and drama and it's those short moments that save an otherwise lackluster picture. The standout performance is Pierce, whose menacing and aggressive character is strengthened by his incredibly creepy hairstyle. Hardy and LaBeouf, two of Hollywood's stronger 21st century leading men, are finally starting to get some beefy and challenging roles, and they both clearly take pleasure in bringing these rough gangsters to life. Love interests Jessica Chastain and Mia Wasikowski aren't given much to do in this male-dominated plot, but they truly anchor the motivations of the other characters in many key scenes. Visually speaking, this is a beautiful motion picture, making the drab, brown, and dark Appalachian countryside look almost exotic in its deep fog and dense woodlands. The final standoff between the law and Franklin County's finest bootleggers is a gripping action sequence that plays out in the shadows of a covered bridge. For all its interesting and exciting moments, though, this is ultimately only effective late. The poor pacing and weak story elements practically cripple this film before it gets going. It's doubtful I'll be compelled to watch this realistically gruesome drama again, but it did just enough to keep me entertained. Lawless. Powerful and engaging. For half. Now let's read a selection of your reviews from the YouTube comments. The Raidomatic 4 Lawless, an 8 and a 6. You applauded the acting and cinematography, but were turned off by a slow plot. Your ratings average to a great. The back half of this film is a true stunner, but the first act nearly had me walking out. I thought this just slightly made up for its flaws, and in the end, it was a good movie. 